Welcome to Excellent MMA. Mohamed Mukayev releases a statement after being cut by the UFC. My dream is to become a UFC champion. I turned them all down because the UFC gave me the platform to put my name out there and earn money to feed my family. By the way, PFL don't have flyweight division. All these journalists that make stuff up are idiots. I hope Dana resigns me. This is my dream, to become champion. I see all your messages. I really appreciate the support. Love you all. Kamaru Usman eyeing for a Bilal Mohamed fight. Kamaru Usman is still not done with his welterweight title aspirations. After Bilal Mohamed secured a decision winner for Lean Edwards at the UFC 304, Usman thinks he can reclaim his title by beating Bilal at the end of the year. However, he understands it may not be realistic because he probably needs to fight one more time before earning a title shot. At end of the year, top of next year, I'll go in there and I get take my uh, my Walter Wish trap back, 100%. But if you're talking to the man that's from the outside looking in to try to satisfy everybody, when you look at the landscape of everything, as the UFC, as a company, you're going to go, okay, I want to get Usman a fight to really show the fans that he's back, to show us that he's back and he deserves a chance to, to potentially go out there and get that title back. So in order to do that, give him... You know, someone at the top, which could be Shafkat Rachmanov, or it could be JDM. Bilal Muhammad responds to Colby Covington's callout. Colby Covington finally gave Bilal Muhammad some attention after his title win at UFC 204. Colby said he would be down to fight Bilal and would do whatever it takes to challenge the new welterweight champion. Bilal laughed at Colby's comments and taunted him for his three losses in title fights.